Hello everyone and welcome back to Gul's channel. Today I am absolutely thrilled to share an amazing recipe with all of you. My very own homemade shawarma sauce and shawarma. Let's dive right in, shall we? To kick things off, we will start with the meat mixture. I am going to add 500 gram of minced meat into the chopper. Now add one medium sized onion, one and a half teaspoon of paprika powder, two tablespoon of yogurt, one teaspoon of salt, two tablespoon of breadcrumbs, one teaspoon of garlic paste, one teaspoon of black pepper. Now blend it, these fantastic ingredients together until they are beautifully combined. It. If you are new, welcome to my channel. And if you haven't already subscribed to my channel, please subscribe to my channel. Your support means a lot to me. Once we are done with the blending, let's move to the next step where we will utilize some plastic wrap magic. I will carefully lay out the meat mixture onto the plastic wrap and expertly shape it into a roll. Once we are done with the rolling, put it the meat into the freezer for about 6 to 7 hours. While our meat is chilling in the freezer, let's make our delectable shawarma sauce. In a pan, we will melt 2 tablespoons of butter, then add 2 tablespoons of flour. Mix it well. After that, we will add 1.5 tablespoons of tomato paste. Give a good stir, then add 1 cup of chicken broth. A gentle stir and some heat will thicken this sauce to a delectable consistency. And voila, our flavorful shawarma sauce is a masterpiece in the making. Keep it aside, we will use later. After our frozen friend has chilled for its required time, we embark on a cutting adventure. If you are enjoying the video, don't forget to like it and leave a small comment. Your support means the world to me. With the assistance of a sharp knife, trust me, it makes a world of differences. We will gracefully slice the meat into thin pieces. The next step is the frying pan where we will use one tablespoon of oil which will bring the slice to life with the golden color and irresistible aroma.
the donor the meat slice let's assemble our shawarma here i am using two medium size tortilla bread for this journey adding one tablespoon of mayonnaise and a few slices of cucumber pickle now add our donut the sliced meat after the donut i'm going to add some fries now i am using my homemade shawarma sauce the homemade shawarma with a gentle touch i will fold the tortilla into a delightful wrap Here I am assembling the second wrap with the same method. Now, for the grand finale, we will introduce a teaspoon of oil to a pan. Now add the shawarma and gently sizzling the shawarma for around half a minute on each side until it is tantalizingly heated through. And there you have it, a symphony of flavors and texture resulting in shawarma that's beyond compare. I genuinely hope you embark on this culinary adventure and enjoy every savory bite as much as I do. Thank you for joining me. And if you like to show your support, remember to subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification bell. Till next video, take care.